Here's your WTF Action News for Thursday, May 16th. Manistee County deputies responded to the Brethren Easy Mart Tuesday afternoon. Witnesses told police that a man came into the store and demanded money from the cashier. He kept his hand in his pocket, making the clerk believe there was a weapon, although no weapon was brandished. An unknown amount of money was turned over to the man, who then got into a truck with another man and left the scene. Both appear to be around 30 years old. They're driving a stolen gray-colored Dodge Dakota with damage to the rear bumper. Police in Flint are investigating after a child suffered a deadly gunshot wound early Wednesday morning on East Philadelphia Avenue. The incident occurred at 2.34 a.m. and the investigation indicates a child sustained a fatal gunshot wound inside the home. The state police added that free gun locks are available at any Michigan State Police post. Authorities are investigating a crash where a vehicle drove into the Vienna Township Hall in Clio. The crash was reported around 7 p.m. Tuesday and first responders used hydraulic rescue tools to cut the vehicle apart and extricate two people inside while it remained wedged in the building. Both people were hospitalized with unknown injuries. Investigators are still looking into what caused the crash. After a security alert, Traverse City Police responded to a store early Wednesday morning. When they arrived with a canine unit, they saw someone inside taking cash from a drawer. A 19-year-old Ohio man came out of the store when instructed by police. They also found a mask, a hatchet, and packs of cigarettes that the man had stolen from the store. He was arrested and the investigation is ongoing. The community walking group meets this morning and every Thursday morning in the library parking lot. Call 724-6796 for more information. Elkona native Boyd Bilek will share his experiences from 13 trips to Ukraine to deliver humanitarian aid. The event will be held this evening at the New Life Lutheran Church in Spruce. Refreshments are provided for this free event and donations will be accepted. Call 307-286-4807 for details. Stand by. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one, and cue music. On this day in 1976, Patti Smith made her UK debut at the Roundhouse in London. The singer, songwriter, poet, and visual artist became a highly influential component of the New York City punk rock movement with their 1975 debut album, Horses. Liberace was born on this day in 1919. The pianist, singer, and TV presenter had a career that spanned four decades and at one time was the highest paid entertainer in the world. He died in February of 1987. According to the National Weather Service, we'll see some increasing clouds with a high near 60. Winds from the northeast at around 5 miles an hour. There's a chance of showers and thunderstorms overnight with a low around 47. Rain continues into Friday, gradually clearing throughout the day, with a high temperature near 61 degrees. WTF Action News is a public service of your local community radio station, WXTFLP Harrisville. Right here in Elkona County, Michigan.